Greetings, everybody, from the Dank Basement. I am Paul, your squicked Uncle Dinky, wicked Uncle Squinty. How you doing? I wish I had some sitar music going because I'm going to be looking today at Super Kailash from Six Photo. Now, I like the Kailash, but this is a snuff apart. This is a very different experience from the Kailash and in most ways better. For one thing, this has higher nicotine. Let's take a look at it in the tub and see what we have here. This is fairly moist, fairly fine grind. I believe this to be a dark snuff. I'm going to put my headphones back on. I'm sitting here with Snuff Anybody McFeagle on Skype. Uh, what would you say is the color of the Super Kailash, Alex? Oh, it is a golden brown, all right? It smells like a black, like it should be a black snuff. It's a golden almost with a reddish tint, says Alex. All right, I'll take your word for it. Now, in the tub, you get a light floral scent out of this, a little hint of mint. Um, you can't really smell the base tobacco at all in this, at least not in the tin. As I said, the grind is fine. Not real moist, but it does adhere to the fingertips, which is a good thing means it's going to be a little easier to sniff. Uh, this is available from Mr. Snuff, Snuff Store, snuffme.co.uk. So all the usual suspects as far as acquiring this. And it comes in a tub like this, which contains 30 grams, or it comes in a 7 gram thimble that, uh, if I can find one here, looks something like this. I call these thimbles, these little tubs. As I said, silky grind, smells good in the tub. Let's see what we have once we put it in the nose. <coughs> Excuse me. Not a hard sniff at all. Very easy to take. First thing that hits you is a fra face freezing blast of mint, not menthol. This is definitely a mint, and it is a sweet mint. Uh, I would say like a sweet peppermint sort of scent to this. And speaking of pepper, there's a little tiny edge of white pepper to this, although not much. Instead of an incense sort of smell, which we associate with many of the Indian snuffs, this is more of a floral, although I'll be damned if I can figure out what flower I'm smelling. Almost right away, you get a nicotine pulse in the side of your nose. This indicates to me that the nicotine on a scale of 1 to 10, where 1 is nothing, and 10 is you're in danger of dying, this is going to be about a 6 or 7 in nicotine. I'm going to say a 7, because even with the tiny apple seed size pinch I just did, divided between two nostrils, I'm already feeling the nicotine. I will say this, out of the non-medicated, traditional Indian six photo snuffs, this is by far and away my favorite. Partly because it is not incensey. It does persist in the nose a good long time. But if you take, and, and Alex, thank you for pointing this out to me, if you take a second pinch of it, which I'm going to do now, you take a second pinch, the mint is much less present. It, might, it has much less impact. Let's try it and see if uh, Alex was correct on that. Oops, dropped a little. There we go. Yeah, you'd still feel the mint, but it's not nearly as uh, present. Now, as the snuff works through its life cycle in your nose, which takes about 20 minutes of persistence, as it approaches the end of that 20 minutes, the mint and the sort of incense floral edges go away. And what you get are very nice herbs. Now, we've already talked about the consistency, the color, the nicotine, which is strong, and the general scent profile. But another thing to th think about is the back drip on this. The back drip is exceedingly pleasant. I get a little bit of salt uh, at the top of my so soft palate, a uh, little tiny bit of saltiness, and then a, uh, I want to say bittersweet, but not in a bad way. It's very organic, very botanical. Uh, going down the back of your nasal passages into your throat. 
it's almost um, a grassy or lemongrass sort of scent to it, uh, flavor. It is really, really pleasant. I'm getting almost even a little hint of basil here. Um, yeah, it's quite nice. On the squinty scale, where one is disgusting and five is deliscious, this rates a solid five. If you're going to try any of the Indian snuffs from Six Photo, this is the one, I think. This is the Super Kailash from Six Photo of India. Uh, five out of five on the squinty scale all day long, persists for 20 minutes or so, maybe even a little longer. It is not incensey, but it is nicely floral, nicely minty, cooling, and packs an elephant load of nicotine. From the dank basement, I'm your Uncle Squinty Paul. Let's hope this works and hope I was still on camera. Mm.